Hi everyone, so we are at nine full days of incubating these chicken eggs right here. Um, and today I just wanted to do um, a check on the embryo development through candling. This particular incubator comes with a feature where there's lights under each of these eggs. And um, it's supposed to allow you to candle the eggs without having to take the eggs out of the incubator. Um, since these are brown eggs, it is a little bit more difficult to see what the embryo development is. So I think I'm going to have to take these out and uh, candle them manually. This feature might work better with white eggs. But maybe we could do that in another video and check it out. Um, but for now, we're going to use the old um, toilet paper roll trick here. Where you have a toilet paper roll, and you can actually slice it up the middle and then re-tape it to the right diameter that you need. And then you just take a uh, nice strong flashlight and put it in the end of the toilet paper roll. Just like that. And you can see that plenty of light comes out of the end of there. So um, I'm going to take a, uh, uh, a chicken egg that's been fertilized but hasn't been incubated at all. And we can just compare that against the rest. So here is an egg that has not been incubated at all. And you can see that um, the light just goes right through the egg. And there's really nothing inside of there. Flip it over. Okay. So now let's compare that against the eggs that have been incubated for nine days. See, you can kind of see a dark mass in there. That is the embryo starting to develop. Now, if this was a white egg, it would be much more obvious. But I can see that there is something going on in there. Yeah, right at the top here, you can see something developing in there. Flip it over. Oh yeah, I actually think I saw something move. That's the embryo actually moving around in the egg. I don't think you can see that on the video, but it is happening. Oh, yeah, it may be difficult for you guys to see, but there is definitely some embryo development. The light is not shining through this egg like it was for the one that wasn't incubated at all. Yeah, that one you can see a little bit better. It's very dark up here at the top. It's developing well. Yeah. You can see that distinct line right there, the bottom. Yeah, again, if these were white eggs, you'd be able to see um, all those blood vessels developing in there. Uh, you'd be able to better identify the embryo inside. I can, from my point of view, I can see a very dark spot. See, I don't know if you can see that. See it right there? That's the embryo. Yeah, 
yeah, these are all developing nicely. They all look about the same. See a distinct line there. You can see the evergreen right there. See that darker spot right there? Uh, I think it, yeah, see it move? It's the embryo moving around. Last one. Let's see if we can find that darker spot. I think I see it. Right about there. Also, I'd like to mention um, the eggs in the incubator should be pointy side down, and you want to just kind of tilt them to the side a little bit when you put them back in. Um, we are on nine full days. At day 18, I'll raise the humidity level a little bit. And hopefully these all hatch for us. Again, if you're not subscribed, please do so. Hit that notification bell and give this video a thumbs up. And I will get back with you next weekend and we will rekindle these and see uh, how they're developing. Thank you for watching, everyone. See you next time.